Hi everyone, in this tutorial, I will show you how to render volume areas. For that, we need volume to work on. So I'll just use this preset. Select this explosion. Let's go to 30th frame. So we will render this and it has density temperature heat also so let's create camera from perspective and let's quickly render this so let's select this camera awesome so now we need rgb noise on this so let's create that noise i'll scatter some particles on density I will need some RGB noise on this. For that, I need to use attribute noise. Okay, so this is basically a 2D noise, right? I will use color RAM to convert this into RGB. So let's drop down color RAM from attribute. I'll use noise. Let's edit attribute noise and yeah, cool. And also, I will rename this into a from CD and RGB P4 pass. Okay, so now it has rgb noise i'll use rasterize so make sure it has low particle scale and we will use this rgb noise yeah cool and also this will convert into vdb so let's convert this also into vdb we will use post process convert this into VDB yeah everything is VDB now cool so and also if I middle click on this it has 0.15 voxel and here also let's do that okay cool so we will render this let's check now okay so it's not yet visible for first let's use rgbp we need to add that over here rgb -P. okay so now we have so but it has no information to add information in it so i'll use just rgb still it's blank right we need to call that into a shader so to call that we need bind let's stop this for a moment and let's hey rgb p and it's a vector right okay and to export that we need to use bind export this rgb vector okay so now let me render this yes we are getting this but first we need to fix two things first is it's not matching this final output and second is it has like a really high values somewhere so second one we let's fix that now so here we need to use close surface yeah so here we are getting that right cool so now how do we match those output properly over here now you can see it has low density and low alpha over here right and but it's not the it's not following the same 
so f to do that let's go over here now so if you see over here it has density and it is doing something over it so whatever we are going to change density or intensity or something it's going to like process that thing and we have to it's a simple mathematics we have to multiply that this value with our AOVs to get the proper output and how do we do that it has like lots of input and outputs for that we need to use this so this is the main output so let's check what it's doing over here yeah so right so it's the main output and also if you go to second correct so let's use this to edit stop this for a moment so to get proper accurate values we will use multiply connect this and second okay so let's render yeah so if you if you check we are getting the proper result yeah, this is it.